The Acting Registrar of Corporate Societies in Ghana, Kwabna Praku Yabwa, has advised members of credit unions to desist from seeking redress from the law courts on issues bothering the unions. He wants them to exhaust all internal means of conflict resolution to avoid waste of time and financial resources. Mr. Yabwa was speaking at the 42nd and 43rd annual general meeting of the Hydro Cooperative Credit Union at Akonsombo in the Eastern Region. My colleague Edwin Kofisian reports. The annual general meeting, which covered three financial years, was on a theme, building resilient hydro cooperative credit union in a competitive market environment. Established in 1971, the union was owned and controlled by the staff of the Volta River Authority. However, it now has a membership of over 14,000, including VRA, Gridco, and B Power Authority staff, who form majority. Other members include public and private workers, individuals, churches, and small-scale and medium-scale enterprises, with a total asset of over 160 million Ghana cities. In his welcome address, board chairman of the Hydro Cooperative Credit Union, Joseph Asari Keteku, assured members of the union's effort at recovering a 60 million cities locked up funds with investment firms. Our SIC financial services, we have about 10.5 million Ghana cities locked up. NTHC financial services, we have about 2.1 million Ghana cities. Gogo security management, also we have about 2.2 million Ghana cities. Relatively put together, about 16 million has been locked up. And the board of directors are still perceiving it. We are told that the government of Ghana has made some funds available, that all persons and institutions who have their funds locked up, the appropriate regulatory authorities will ensure that those funds are refunded to the parties who actually invested in those houses. On the spot, the acting registrar of the cooperative societies, Kwabna Apreku Yabua, advised members of credit unions to resist the temptation of seeking redress at the law court, since the cooperative laws enjoins members to exhaust all internal means of conflict resolution. That if we write court with our issues, we incur costs with regard to legal fees, we have to pay to lawyers and the filing processes at the court. Meanwhile, your cooperative that you take to court is going to use the funds that you have contributed in the cooperative to fight the case. Let us therefore familiarize ourselves with the provisions for grievance handling in our bylaws so that we save ourselves totally avoidable expenditures. The general manager, Edward Ajakwa, revealed to Joy News that the union declared a total dividend of over 25 million Ghana cities from July to December 2021, 2022, and 2023 financial years, out of which 49% was declared to the shareholders. For Joy News, Kofisian Akusumbu.